Yo, what's good, YouTube man? It's Gabriel, just another fan TV. Back at you, another video. Like the content in this video, go ahead and smash that like button, like the content in this channel. Go ahead and hit subscribe, man. You know, uh, definitely like, comment, subscribe all the videos. Push it out to more Ravens fans who want this information. Uh, so the Ravens is coming off a bye week. Get ready to play the Carolina Panthers. And we know the Ravens have had some troubles with injuries going into the bye week. Let's see how they're doing after the bye week right now. Who's practicing, who's not, who's limited. Things like that on this first um, injury report since, you know, coming back, right? So, guys who did not practice today, Ronnie Stanley, Calais Campbell, Justin Houston, Marcus Peters. Now, Ronnie Stanley, Calais Campbell, Justin Houston is your typical rest day. They're still keeping these guys on that same program and that same schedule. So, nothing to worry about there. Those guys who are very important to the team are just on rest days. Now, Marcus Peters is kind of an interesting one because it's like a combination of a rest day slash injury kind of thing. Uh, he still has the quad thing, but... It's still a rest day as well, so the Ravens are kind of going back and forth between keeping them on there. Um, guys who are limited, Mark Andrews with the shoulder and knee, Gus Edwards with the hamstring, and Jalen Armand Davis apparently picked up a muscle injury. Uh, John Harbaugh said during like a special teams portion of practice, and um, he, he left practice after that. So um, it was interesting because with Mark Andrews, the reporters initially didn't see him out there, so I'm guessing that during the session that was available to the media, he wasn't out there probably just in the back. And then once that, once the reporters were uh, asked to leave, that's when Mark Andrews came back out, right? So uh, Lamar said that, you know, they all welcome Mark Andrews back, you know, hugs and things like that. It's great to have him back out there on the field. And um, we'll see what that means for him as we go further and further into the week, if he's going to play or not. There's still no guarantee. Like, it's still limited, you know? So, and that's two different injuries for Mark Andrews. So, you know, we'll see what the Ravens do um, as the week goes along, all right? Um, guys that are practicing, um, Jason Pierre-Paul has been a full participant in practice today. He came and he left the uh, Saints game with an injury, like an ankle injury. Didn't play a lot of snaps. I think he played something like seven snaps in that game. Uh, very low amount because he had an ankle injury. But like the bye week did him some good. And he's actually practicing uh, in full. Jason Pierre-Paul really hasn't been a guy who has practiced since he's been here with the Ravens. So that's interesting that he was practicing today. It's also it's a good sign. So it's good to see him back out there on the field. All right. Now, one that's interesting is Deshaun Jackson, right? The reporters said they didn't see Deshaun Jackson on the field. You know, he's still dealing with the hamstring injury. But when the Ravens released the official injury report today, Deshaun Jackson wasn't listed on it, right? So uh, I'm not 100% sure what's going on with that. Either um, he's not practicing and something else is going on, or the fact that it's kind of the same thing with Mark Andrews is the fact that uh, he, came out of, he came out to the practice field after the reporters were already gone. Right. They didn't really give any clarification on what's going on with that. So that's something to monitor as we keep going on longer in the week. Um, what is the health status of a guy like Deshaun Jackson? Right. So that's the Ravens injury report. Right. All the key guys that are on it are coming back as far as Ronnie Stanley, Clayus Campbell, Justin Houston. Gus Edwards is like he, he he's limited, but look like he's in line to play. Uh, Harbaugh also said that David Ojabo and Charlie Kohler, um, they're still ramping up, but they have a chance to play this weekend. So we could see the two rookies that we haven't seen this weekend as well. So the Ravens could have a first opportunity to get the entire draft class out there. So that would be good to see. And uh, especially for David Ojabo, keep boosting up this Ravens pass rush. JC Pierre Paul coming back, him coming back. Ty Spouse and keep getting better and better. This defensive line that, like we said, it was going to be weak for a little bit, is now one of the strongest points on this team, right? So, um, that's good to see. I want to keep an eye on Deshaun Jackson, see what's going on with that. Because when he did play versus Saints, it was pretty good. I'm not going to lie, all right? Uh, he was moving pretty well, but he is 36, so he's prone to an injury like a hamstring, right? Uh, so, well, hopefully that is not too bad for him to recover from and that, you know, we'll see Deshaun Jackson more and more as the season goes along. Um, and Mark Andrews, same thing. You know, we'll, we'll keep an eye on Mark Andrews, see what happens. Um, in my opinion, I think the Ravens could sit him out another week. Uh, not saying that you take any opponent lightly. I'm not saying that at all. But Isaiah Likely is playing really well. So let him continue to get snaps, get comfortable, keep playing, and uh, let Mark Andrews rest up. You know what I'm saying? So um, I would love to see him out there if he can play. I'm not. I have nothing against it. But you know, if he gets if he gets the rest another week, I got I got no problem with that either. All right. Um, so that's the Ravens injury report in full, and uh, the guys are looking in good shape, and uh, this team is getting healthy at the right moment. Uh, eventually, they'll get Marcus Williams back and guys like that as well. So, uh, the Ravens are on the uptick in terms of the injury report. So, that's good to see, all right? 
Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe on all these videos. Share it out. Like I said, for Ravens fans who want this content. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, hopefully you come back again. And uh, you have a great day. This is Gabriel with the Fan TV. I'm out.